welcome to another Fallout 76 video. Today I'm going to show you an easy route for blight so that we can make blight soup as you can see there on the screen. It gives us extra critical damage. It's only showing 20% there but we'll get it up to 50% and I'll show you after. So let me show you on the map. We're at the Hornwright testing site 03. Follow my route. The event breaching clear sometimes appears here. So you wouldn't want to do this when that's on. But let's go through the site and your first light is here. Just check that you've got green thumb perk equipped. So we get double the yield. Let's see how high my dragon can count to. That's number one. Number two. We're looking for that little stump. That's number three. Number four. And number five. Now we've got to head to the other side of this little valley to the other tree line. All of the trees. There's number six, number seven, number eight, number nine. Now we've got to turn to our left. And we're going to aim for those two trees together. There's number 11. And number 12. And that's the end of our route. And because we have the green thumb perk card equipped, we got 24. So before you craft, remember to equip super duper. That's a couple of tips now, so once you've made the uh, soup or any consumables, remember you've got uh, a refrigerator and you've got the good with salt perk card to stop your food from spoiling. And why go through all the effort? Because blight soup will give you 50% critical damage if you've got the herbivore mutation and you've equipped strange renumbers and you're grouped with someone else who's mutated. So that's how powerful it is. Hope you enjoyed the videos guys, thanks for watching, if you did, please like and subscribe. Thank you, Dioch!